see one of my machine strike pieces around? Welcome back, Aloy. I see you have recovered Poseidon. I'll be right down. Aloy, I have managed to unlock additional rooms within the facility. Got it. I found that recording from the data on your focus. She's been watching it a lot. I think it helps calm her. You know, I used to watch this a lot too. Whenever I wanted to take my mind off things. Daddy sure does love his little big... But there's something you need to tell me? While you were gone, I came down here to check on her. Then we started talking. Right, Beta? She's been thinking about how to capture Hephaestus, studying the data Gaia gave her. But we started talking about some other stuff. You know, just getting to know each other, right? And then she told me that one of the Zeniths might be different from the others. Tilda. You saw her at the Hades Proving Lab. Go on. On the way to Earth, the Zeniths never showed their faces. My servitor caretaker referred to them as my benefactors and promised I'd meet them someday when I had learned enough. And then, one day, a data channel opened in my training interface. In it, Tilda was waiting for me in a virtual replica of a house on a cliff overlooking the ocean. It was beautiful. She showed me paintings, books, media files. We met there in secret many times. But a few months later, it stopped. Can you tell us why, Beta? I found some data about Tilda at the Hades Proving Lab. I think she was a liaison between Far Zenith and Zero Dawn. She knew Elizabeth Sobek, that's for sure. Maybe that's why she reached out to you? You said that Tilda reached out to you using a data channel? It appeared in my training interface as another assignment. When I opened it, there were a series of intermittent glitches. I realized they formed a transpositional cipher. Instructions on how to open up a new virtual space. When I entered it, my training interface disappeared. Instead of the usual holographic teachers and files, I was in a perfect recreation of her home. And you're sure the other Zeniths never knew about it? To them, it looked like I was still in training. Toiling away. Alone. So this secret virtual space looked like a house with an ocean view? I could see white caps and hear waves crashing on rocks below. And there were gulls crying outside. Inside, Tilda had frames that showed off her favorite paintings, changing at intervals to match the light. There was an armchair she liked. She'd sit there and gaze outside while I looked through her things. 
We spent hours in that house. I never wanted to leave. You said Tilda showed you paintings and let you access media files? Every time we met, she showed me a new painting. I, I think she was Dutch. All of her favorite pieces were from their golden age in the 1600s. Portraits, allegories, ships at sea. She had so many. Did it interest you? I liked her media portal. It had so much more than my training interface. Clips, shows, hollows. My favorite was this one called Second Time Around, about a family whose kid comes back after disappearing during the hot zone crisis. Right, but did this portal have anything about the Zeniths themselves? Anything we could use? No. Any information about them was redacted. What else can you tell us about Tilda? She... liked to talk about her paintings. What about herself? Did she ever... Talk about her life on Earth, how she joined the Zeniths, something like that. She never said much about herself, and she hated it when I asked too many questions. But I think, back on Earth, she was an expert programmer, given that she built a data channel the other Zeniths couldn't detect. Is there anything else about her that we might be able to use to our advantage? She was the first real person who ever bothered to speak to me. I wasn't really assessing her for strengths and weaknesses. So Tilda set up a secret virtual space where she could talk to you, a house on a cliff. Then later, she cut you off. But other than the fact that Tilda knew Elizabeth, you don't know why she did those things? I don't, okay? I thought of every possible reason that would make her leave, but whatever I did wrong, I don't know what it is. When I finally met the others, she ignored me. I acted like the data channel never existed. None of this even matters. Tilda's the same as the others. It won't help us defeat them. Let's leave it at that, then. What's wrong? I'm trying, Varl. But she is tough to take. I'm out there in the wilds, risking my life every day, and all she can do is hide in there and tell us how hopeless it all is. I'm sorry, she's had a rough time, but she is really not helping right now. Hmm. You always seem to be on top of everything, so I sometimes forget about what you've been through. I mean, it wasn't that long ago you were so banged up you couldn't even walk. About that. When I pulled you out of the water back near the proving lab, you were muttering Rost's name. You never talk about him, but he raised you trained you. You must miss him a lot. Of course I do. But I don't have time to think about that now. I need to get back out there. Okay. I'll keep working with Beta. Gaia says she knows a lot about Zero Dawn. And maybe she just needs some time to adjust, and then she can help us with Hephaestus. Sure. But I won't hold my breath.
Looks like some of the holograms are working now. I have repurposed the displays to track Regala's activity in the region. A useful war map. Mind if we have a word? Of course not. I should get going. If I can help in some way, say the word. I will. Thank you. Huh. That door is unlocked now. There's a lot of equipment in here. Gaia? What was all this for? According to this console, there are still thousands of plant samples stored deep below the facility. I could ask Gaia about them the next time I talk to her. I've been tackling the... I've been tackling the design of the Ag Lab. Place is gonna have a lot of seed stock to work with. My favorite? Sample 626. Calotropis gigantea. The crown flower. We used to have one in our backyard. Butterflies always fluttering around. Every morning, August would run out there to check under the leaves. See if any caterpillars turned into chrysalises. Now... Looks like someone's put some of my stuff in here. Aloy, I see you found your room. Your companions thought you would appreciate a private space of your own. I was thoughtful of them. I've been carrying Elizabeth's pendant with me for months. But since we're gonna stay a while, I think I'll keep it here, where it'll be safe. My old spear. Rust helped me make it when I finished my training. Feels like so long ago now. This is the rite of passage that Vashav gave me at the embassy. I liked him. He seemed like a good man. I think he was really looking forward to going home. Drone's reconnected now. Hey, Gaia. I'm back. So I see what is on your mind. So this, it was meant to oversee the... Had they would have as that? Until Minerva decided to settle here. So the Hades proving it used to... Yeah, the facility, it appeared. I guess it wasn't enough to build automate. He wanted virus. I should be... Goodbye, Ada.
Felt cold enough for us. No? Machine down quick with shock ammo. It's not like I have to go anywhere. Come, show respect. Trade. we can use it for storage. That doesn't make you eligible for a discount. There's another locator beacon on the same frequency.
Red hair, keen eye, big spear. Those ingredients mean a Nora warrior. Aloy, you defeated Regella at the Grove, right? There's not a rumor in the land that doesn't cross the cook pot. Kitchens chop up the meat and stir in the gossip. And was what you said to that Tanakh soldier just gossip? About food that can make her stronger? You think soldiers are the only ones with skills? Blades aren't just for war. Slice up the right ingredients and you'll be stronger in the field. With the correct preparation. This meal can make me stronger? Stronger, healthier, more resistant. There are all sorts of benefits depending on how I prepare it. You vary your diet, you benefit from the different properties of the food. Look at the Osaram. They drink all that beer and come out barrel shaped. So why is it so hard to believe that food can change you in other ways? Your friend doesn't seem convinced by your claims. The people here would stick their heads in the ground and drill out their dinners like grazers if they could. But I'm convinced if I show Hakata here, if I show any of them the benefits, then the others will come around. What ingredients do you need? Some bird meat and a little mystery ingredient. If it stays a mystery, I won't be able to get it for you. Wild bird's eggs. These soldiers won't touch them. They claim warriors only eat meat. But a true warrior takes every advantage. I'll get you those ingredients. See, Hakata? True soldiers aren't cowards in the kitchen. You can get the eggs from the island in Desert's Tier, the lake just outside the walls. As for the meat, plenty of birds feed in the grasses around the shores. Bring the ingredients back here, and you'll get that meal for free. Good to see you, warrior. You There should be goose eggs on this island, if I can find the nests. That's one. Useful for making dyes. Must be another nest. Could look around with my focus. Oh, 
That's another egg. That one. That's all the eggs. Time to get back to Salt Bite.
Ready. It's time for us to prepare the chef's special. How did you know I had your ingredients? Every cook worth their salt can read people as well as they can cuts of meat. Fakata, let us work our magic. May the courage of your stomach bring you victory in battle. We'll be here whenever you desire more delicacies and your next meal will be on the house. That's so, one. Hakata. All right. If that Nora will risk the chef's special, I will try it. But if that slime sickens me, it's your whining that turns. Pick mm, your meal, warrior. That's right. We're here when you're hungry. You, they're bright. 